Well, hello again everyone. Uh, last time I was talking about expanding outwards, building some forts, and uh, possibly securing the area outside my current boundary. Well, I've done some of that. You see there, these three you know, vertical lines here, those are forts that I've already built. Built those things just so I can see them from a distance. There's more of them. There's one behind there which we can't see, and then there's more that way. I just loaded the game so you see the the landscape is loading. So um, I thought I'll record myself building one of them so you guys can see how I go about doing it. Uh, we'll go south this time. And there's also issues with the landscape, pre-biomes and post-biomes, that uh, well, we'll see when we get there. I need to think about how to deal with it. Because when when Notch uh, introduced the biomes, the land, the landscape generation algorithm was obviously changed, and so the old bits don't really match up with the new bits. And yeah, I have to decide what to do about that. Whether to just leave it because what happens is, like you know, you have half a mountain and then suddenly it cuts off, and then on the other side there'll be an ocean, for example, and it doesn't look very really natural, of course, but that's how the game did it, so anyway, we'll talk about that when we get there. So the idea is to move far enough away so that we just see the tower, so you know, we don't get completely lost. So we just see the tower and maybe we just see see that's the other fort there behind a the tree. I need to find a nice spot. So I've never been here before. Well, I built that fort well behind the tree there, but I haven't been this way. So we've got a, an ocean and a cliff, and the crystal tower is there. Let's see. Trees and I'm gonna have to punch these trees down. That's one of them. So, yeah, so we can barely see the crystal tower still. We see that thing on top of the mountain. And these are some of the other mountains that were behind that one. Yeah, these are the names for these. <laughs> this mountain, the other mountain. Okay, I guess this spot, I think, would be a good place for a fort. Uh, let's see, the plan is. Seven blocks by seven blocks. So one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Three, four, five, six. So just a little one. Doesn't need to be big. Let's chop down this tree as well. And I'll punch down this tree as well. And then first thing is to lay down the cactus, give it a little bit of time to grow. Usually it doesn't grow to its full height in in the day, so cactus has to be placed diagonally. You can't place two of them right next to each other, you can't place anything next to the cactus, they just fall apart if you do. Built about let's see one two three four five six seven. I think I've built seven or eight forts already. So I've standardized the design. The first few were 
a little different, but this is this I think is the most efficient one. Uh, we want the entrance to face north because that's where my base is. Flat in this area, but pick up some saplings. Not that I need them, but. Put down the cactus earlier, just cause if we give it some time to grow, we'll be better off. I'm trying to work quickly because I want to get this done before night falls. Create a little. No, oh, sorry for that. We'll create a little overlap here because you know monsters don't know how to go around things. So mm -hmm. we do this, then they walk straight into cactus. Whereas if I just leave a gap like that, then obviously it won't catch everyone or every zombie and creeper. But if we do this, then you know they won't they won't know to come around this way to go into. My fort. So it's a bit better defended. Alright. Uh, torches. Torches. I might chop down this tree as well. No, I'll leave it. Torch, torch. Torch, we just put it down wherever. Alright, that's good, that's good, that's good. Uh, yeah, sure, here, why not? Um, door goes here. Workbench. Oops, hold on. Oops, make a door. Door. Make a pressure plate. Pressure plate, awesome. And carry your table with you. Great. Uh, right, walls. I'm doing quite well. It's only a little bit after midday. And. Two blocks. down. Two blocks and then a little platform. Oops, out of dirt. And platform. And then parapet. Torches inside. Let's see. There. Torches up top. And also, see that that's the other fort there. And build the same thing a little spire. One, 
two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Light up the top, point towards home base, and then go back down again. Alright, so, yeah, just as the sun is setting. I might run over there. I don't want the video to drag on too long. Yeah, I'll run over there and show you. Hopefully, it's close. Show you what happens at the boundary between. Hmm, hope we can get back up again. The boundary between the old map before the biomes and the new stuff after the biomes. So if we, you can see there, a huge mountain of sand, that's obviously new. Like the old algorithm wouldn't generate something like that. Let's see there, let's see how the mountain is just cut off. Uh, nightfall... Yeah, so it, it's... This is quite a clear line between where the old stuff is and where the new stuff is. I mean, like, deserts are cool, but... You know? And especially there, <laughs> where the mountain just cuts off. I don't know. I don't know what to do about that. I guess it's a convenient... Uh, wait. What's that water doing? Anyway. I guess it's a convenient point to just say, well, I'll light up, well, I'll secure up to this point. I might use that as a boundary, and it goes in a rough square all the way around my home base at that distance. I'll probably... Yeah, I'll probably secure everything inside the line for now. Oh, that that's like the next thing I want to do, but... Oh, that's pretty cool. But what to do after that? What to do about that? I might build a... I don't know, a wall? On that line? Or I might... I mean, one of the options is to try to smooth it out and make it look natural, so get rid of the the cliffs and everything. And, you know, artificially make it look natural, which, you know, it's kind of a... I don't know. I don't know. I'll have to think about what to do about it. But yay, deserts. Yay, biomes. Look how big that mountain is. And all of that is within the line. Alright, so it's night time, and pigs are killing themselves on the cactus. And not much to do until daybreak. I... Yeah, I'll cut the video here. I think I have a little bit more to add. I might... Ooh, bacon. Yeah, bacon. Uh... Yeah, I'll cut the video, and then I'll add a little bit to the end. I'll go back to the tower, not to the top, and I'll show you the forts that I've built so far from that vantage point. Ooh, skeletons. Alright, let me sit here until morning. And it's morning! Wow, that was fast, wasn't it? Um, let's see what's outside. Any creepers? Zombies? Skeletons? Oh. There's a creeper. A creeper having a swim in the lake. Surprisingly, not not that many men enemies. There's a zombie, a uh, skeleton. I just saw him behind the trees. Those guys would die when the sun comes up. I need to. Well, I don't really need to get rid of that creeper as long as it doesn't come this way. All right, I'll leave it. That is cool, an overhang. But uh, it's quite a long way away. It'll be a while before I get that far. Yeah, burn! Burn! Alright, um, next thing will be to put a line of torches back to the base. And then we go up top and have a look. Alright, let's go. 
careful not to walk into your own cactus trap. Hmm. More torches, creepers. Yeah, we're safe. Whoa. Whoa. Keep moving. Don't look at it. Don't make eye contact. Oh, crap. Did it s see me? Hmm. Okay, I need to. I would need to get rid of it. I do need to get rid of it, I think. Oops. Ooh, arrows. That's good. I did an aggro. That's interesting. Too far away. Alright. Okay, that's better. Uh, let's see, where does this path go? Torches. Hello cow, hello sheep. How are you today? Torches. Yeah, that'll work. And then down to the beach, where the other torches are. So yeah, that line of torches had leads to um that fort there. Jump up. And we're back home. Great. So yeah, that's what I've been doing for a few days. So fought there, fought there, fought there, and then a new one just around the co Hmm, it's behind the trees, I think. Yeah, we can't really see it from here. It's there, just behind that tree. That's all right. And I thought somewhere to the north as well. There's one there, and one there, and one behind that hill. So about. You know, a semicircle, halfway, or well, maybe like sixty percent. Um, we might have to wait until nightfall to see it more clearly. See the lit up forts in the night against the the other darker areas. Up and up and up and up and up. So that's what we built just now. Hmm, we can't see that one. And the clouds partly obscuring that one. The first one I built was actually just outside of range, like it's just behind there. I meant to build it like there, you know, so we can see it, but uh messed that one up. But all the other ones are just within range, so you can see, you know, that little vertical bit there, and that bit there, and that bit there. And also... Yeah, there we go, that bit there. So, yeah. Next up will be to continue building those around, probably like there, and then behind the mountain there. Well, we won't be able to see the tower, I don't think the crystal tower from behind the mountain, but we'll see that thing. So I'll probably build it within sight of that. And let's see. The one just now was there. Whoa, don't fall down. Was there, so I guess one, two, three. And that'll be it. I'll wait till nightfall and then show you the lights at night. And it's evening, sun setting behind the mountain. It looks kind of nice. 
but uh, there we go. So, wow, that's kind of slow. Probably because it's recording. So yeah, the lights pointing the way to the forts. So two there, two, one across the the island. To that way, behind the cloud, can't really see it. One there, one there, one there, and one behind there. Actually, yeah, we can see it from here. So yay, expanding outwards. And someday soon, all of that will be lit up and part of my domain. Alright, that's it for today. See you later.